During a retreat with my local mom's group, my friend taught us how to make these really cute mini Mary gardens. It was such a fun craft and simple enough for everyone to do. I knew I wanted to share it with you here on my channel. This would be the perfect Catholic craft to do with your women's group, teens or tweens in a youth group, or a mom or child project that you could work on together. All of the supplies for this project were donated by my local mom's group. And if you'd like to donate art supplies for a future project here on my channel, you can do so through my Buy Me A Coffee page wish list. For this project, you will need any glass container, shadow box, lantern, etc a mini Mary car statue. These three inch car statues are small enough to fit in my five inch glass container. You can also find Jesus and the saints as well. You'll need moss, rocks, flowers, wooden discs, and glue. There are lots of different types of glue that are great for different materials, but for the sake of simplicity, I chose to use hot glue. All of the products are linked in the description and I include options for if you want to buy multiples for a group or just single items if you want to do it by yourself. First, decide how elevated you want your Mary to be. Wooden discs can be glued and stacked to make her higher if desired. There were also women in our group who were using the wooden discs to create like little stairs or halos, which I thought was really cute. I found it helpful to do a practice run with the supplies I liked the best before putting them in my container. It helped me get a feel for how to arrange the different elements before committing to gluing things down permanently. When you're ready, start by arranging elements like Mary and the rocks first, and then you can glue them down as needed. You don't have to glue anything down, but it can help secure things if you don't want things to move around. Once the rocks and Mary have been placed down, arrange the moss around Mary and the glued objects. You can add flowers if desired. I added flowers with tacky glue, but for this example, I liked the contrast of the moss against the white stones and I wanted to keep it simple. After you finish, you'll want to find a place to display your mini Mary garden. Every week I post new Catholic inspired art tutorials like this one. Feel free to check them out and I would love to see how your mini Mary gardens turned out. Feel free to tag me on social media. I want to remind you that you are loved. God loves you very much and he loves your artwork very much. Thank you so much for following along and I'll see you in the next video.